Steven Seagal, what hasn't been said about this legend of a man? He's an enigma wrapped in a mystery, wrapped in a conundrum, wrapped in bacon, who loves carrots. <laughs> Let's watch some of his videos and have a laugh. Let's get into it. When Seagal jumps out the sedan, looking like Kung Fu Toei boy, with the jet black swag of a million men carrying the carrot colored coat. Seagal don't walk fast for nobody, too. You could tell. He's the kind of guy that's like, get around me, pace yourself, efficient steps. We're gonna give you a bullet. He's laughing. He's like, ha ha. I've shot many fake bullets in my movies. Uh oh, when he puts on the white top with the black long situations on the legs. He don't even bow when he gets on the mats. The mats bow to him. He bows when he gets mid mat. You see that? He got to the red line. He said, I'll bow now. He bows when he wants. Us. Us for sure. How do you let yourself go that much? Like, listen, no one loves food more than me. You can see it in my neck starting to grow. I love food. Uh, but listen, dude, I'm not letting myself get that stomach. No amount of money is going to make me that complacent. Go ahead. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me and fall or flip. All right, so you know that won't work, right, guys? You know that won't work, right? Now, the initial wrist lock would work for sure because he trapped the fingers. Hand stuff first, okay? Gonna do some hand stuff first. Some hand sanitizing. We're gonna touch each other's cuticles real quick. First he leads them, and then he says, now you can't leave. But no, but no, but no, but no, he won't flip. Kamura with the calves. You know, you guys have seen my short where I talked about this. This is one of my favorite moves in the world, where he uses his calves to do a Kamura. You better tab, boy. Ooh, ooh. Calves on your forearm. He just walks away aimlessly into the corner. He's like, I'm done. I don't want to even converse with y'all. Avert your eyes. The clothesline, boy. Shout out to WWF. We got Bradshaw coming through with the clothesline from hell. So he, he pats you and he hits you with the forearm. Even once a god trains, he wears a bib. Oh, God. So swag with it. So swag with it. With the smile. With the crazy beard of life. Right? The beard rides low on the chin. A lot of skin area in there. Right? You would think it would come up to the lip. He said, nah, I want it just here. But I want it full here, though. He put the bib inside. Instead of doing the clothesline, he's going to do the V-shape on the trachea. What do you guys think about this so far? Is Aikido the real deal? Or is this just, uh, uh, just, just bullshit? Now I understand before anyone gets mad in the comments, I know that it's meant for sword fighting typically. So I'm not sitting here shitting on, on the art. I don't, I'm not privy to all the idiosyncrasies of the, of the art itself. But what I will say is there's a lot of fugaziness going on. There's a lot of weird flipping. I hate excess movement. You see what I'm saying? How come you just don't block, land the shot, and then like he he falls back, right? My man did a back cartwheel, you know? No. Why does he have to cartwheel out of frame is my whole perspective. If that's martial arts, then I'm about to quit. I don't even want to be associated with martial arts anymore. He just went forward with two hands and said, Hyah! You want this? Yeah. Try that. I'm done with teaching grappling, cage wrestling, arm bars, leg locks, boxing, kickboxing. Done, bro. I want to show you how to ya and then try that. And I want to walk around like this, bro. I'm tired of wearing rash guards. I want to wear a bib inside of my kimono that flaps out just enough for you to know I'm sweating in the tit area. Oh, you better flip. Once the golf starts watching you, you better flip. What's the comments like on this seminar video? Let's take a look at some of the comments. Oh, comments are turned off. Off? <laughs> Been in New York for too long, eh? Comments are turned off, you piece of shit. From here, this is better. Okay, I love it. And <laughs> just like you would have expected, he will finish after the wrist lock with a Kimura using his what? Drop it in the comments. Come here. Juju Gatami, a little wrist lock action, and then I'm gonna finish you off with that lovely. So from my observations from this one seminar, my main issue, you can go through all the various combinations of predetermined movements. It doesn't necessarily mean that you're gonna be able to actually use these in combat because it's not pressure tested, meaning you need to spar. There needs to be something at stake for you to really develop this into your muscle memory. You know what would be cool? If they did all the clotheslines, added some cool shit in there, kept some of the wrist locks and flank options, but just added like a good stance, you know? The beautiful stuff that we've gained from superior striking arts. Why not implement that and evolve Aikido? There's so many disciplines that are continually evolving, and then we look at things like Aikido, and it seems to be set in stone. To be honest with you, you should use your 
<laughs> that might actually break the grip. Um, just the flipping at the end, right? We don't need the, the extra flipping at the end. Come in here with your whole body. You said tail to them. Make sure you guys leave a like. It helps the algorithm so more people can find the channel. If you're enjoying the content, maybe someone else will too. Appreciate you. Let's get back into it. Well, if you stand up, then I'll put you in. Oh, oh, oh. Straight arm lock, boy. He's like, that's it. That's how I do what I do. Don't disrespect me. Don't wrist lock with one hand, and you better bow, boy. And if you stand up, you get this. Oh, switch to an arm lock. Get out of here. Flip backwards for some reason. Okay, hands up. Yeah, my bib is chilling a young steven seagal looking dapper looking slim no bib in sight really ready to get to work anyone who wants to can get it so just know that right out the gate oh don't no 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 miss me miss me eternally boy come at me with that that that's that smile boy <laughs> that style boy flips flips continuous flips thumb locks man i got this motherfucker looking like a wiggly wiggly man oh through the throat through the hands <laughs> You, you never saw me. You thought you did, but then I was over here. Wop. And I fixed my hair mid and throw, boy. You know, last time the guy disrespected me, he got clothes on. Simple. Oh, the hand. He said, beat it, nerd. Come and get it. Oh, hamstring stretch at the, f I hit your neck, stretch your hamstring. Bong, flip move into the Kamura with the calf. When he was young, he was all about hurting you. Wrist lock, wrist lock, wrist lock, wrist lock. Stand up, tapping on himself, extra theatrics into a flip move. You can't really get close to me, boy, because Steven Seagal is lava right now. Boom, he's, I'm just gonna touch you when you're gonna flip. He said, you know what? I'm not even gonna hit you. You know, the next step is why even touch him? Why even touch these guys? Just look at him, they'll flip. This is the most agreeable group of individuals I've ever seen. Oh, 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 flips galore. Flips galore. <laughs> oh, they got him. They almost got him. He fell off the mats. Oh, wrist locking. He got the knee on the butt. He got a wrist lock. These two guys are in shambles. They're just in witness of this. They're just straight up. They're like, this is amazing. Be gone, peasants. Be gone. He's like, yo, after that, I gotta pray. Ooh. Look what I got. I don't think Akito is gonna help you apprehend a bad guy. That's just the reality of life. You gotta hit him here to take his take his mind. I don't know what that means, man. Vague statements. Speed and technique are very, very important, but it all is predicated on your wisdom when and how to use it. That's a fact. So let's give Steven Seagal a little bit of credit. That's an actual factual statement. If you don't know when and how to use the techniques that you're using, all the athleticism in the world won't really get the job done. All right, what do you guys think of Steven Seagal? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Is he the real deal or is he really just a hoax? A hoax of a man. Is he the Bigfoot of martial arts? I mean, we've seen him, but like he, he ain't real about it. You know, he's not real. As always, leave a like. It helps the algorithm and subscribe if you're here and you haven't. We're going to keep these videos coming every single week. Want to go this way? I want to go this way. I want to go this way. Okay. 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 Okay.